Hey guys, welcome to my channel, and today we're talking about my t-shirt business. Hey guys, so I'm a young entrepreneur. Now we always get that word messed up. I'm a young entrepreneur, and I decided, you know what? I'm really bored. There's so many things to do here, right? You know, and it's Corona. It's really um, a waste of time, you know. So many things, school, whatever. I have so much free time. Sleep. There is not a better time or opportunity to start working on your goals, your dreams, your vision, your new language, your Shopify store, your merchandise. Why are you not expanding right now and using this time to your advantage? Bro, I don't know. I was just sleeping. You gotta be making the most of this time right now. You have nothing to do. School's canceled. School's out. No one has a job to do. Why aren't you starting your business right now? Why aren't you working on your working from home and creating your own online income? Why aren't you being self-employed right now? You could employ yourself. So you know what? I made a t-shirt business so basically um, here I got my website I made it through uh, Wix which is free obviously but um, you know you, you can pay to get your own domain so basically I, I did a quick and dirty job I just used a basic template I didn't really change much and I used the uh, printful and with printful basically it's print on demand so basically uh, I got a few designs. Let's go in. Uh, let's go to my shop. All right. So here are the designs that I have done. All right. So <laughs> this is funny. So I got the idea, basically from this. This is this will start it all. So I was watching Atlanta's tactics, Atlanta's tactics stream, and basically he was on stream and he said something about fake or real fake T-shirts. How basically uh, Fubo, or yeah, how Fubo, this brand, which is like a street, sh uh, like a street hip hop type brand, the fake version ended up making more money than the real version. So then he started talking about fake real shirts as, as a website, and then somebody registered his domain, real fake t-shirts. There we go, real fake t-shirts.com. And he redirects to his store. He didn't do that. Some fan, some viewer, uh, bought the domain and registered his name. So that's how we get uh, real fake T-shirts. That you know. So basically, um, I'm not sure if this is copyright or this is copywritten. I'm not sure if uh, stealing his idea um, would, would would have legal problems on me. So I'm not sure. This is all just hypothetical. I didn't, I'm not making any money off this, by the way. This is just a way to make money. This is all more of a like a test bench, sort of say. So basically, um, so basically, he made a limited edition version of his shirt um, because uh, it was for a skit. Basically, it was a limited edition uh, version of his shirt. I think it may be here. If it's not here, I don't know how to find it. Uh, clothing. Yeah, if it's not here, it's gone. Uh, yeah, okay, it's not here. So, basically, he made a skit, right? And he made this shirt uh, to go along with the skit. And I basically copied it, right? So, I'm like, yeah, I made a shirt, and he was charging 20 bucks for it, right? $19.99. I made the exact, exact same shirt. Exact same shirt. Maybe different, different actual shirt. But the same exact font though, right? It's a, it's a cheaper uh, Gildan shirt, I'm pretty sure I made. And it has the exact same font and everything to be printed. And the way it works is that this price is the price of the shirt with tax included, right? With tax. With shipping included also to the U.S. So I select my size. And it's a dynamic, for example. There you go. 13 bucks instead of 10 45 because of the size. Now, I, got, now, I think I make $250 profit on this. So I make 250 profit on every shirt, which is a lot, and it's still ha half the price of what Lions was charging. So I think that's a pretty good deal. So then I decided, hmm, what's a better way to make even more money, right? So I so I go to uh, so my high school they have um, classes, shops as they say, 
and um, I decided I want to make um, you know shop apparel you know so I made uh, some things like uh, oh uh, this is my second actual the second actual shirt I made I made uh, the coronavirus t-shirt because why not capitalize on something so serious make a little laughter out of it it's a pretty nice shirt if I don't say so myself um, I was I was thinking about calling it meme shirts because I wanted to make a bunch of memes and make t-shirts and this is my way of making money now I've just you know put my school logo on a couple of shirts you know have some people wear it and the, these are like not these are like generic templates you can put on change it up a little bit you know uh, basically have the logo school logo and a couple of shirts put a little description and if you use uh, printful.com you can make your own website um, and do the same thing where it's basically drop shipping but um, yeah, it's basically drop shipping with no risk to you. Um, <laughs> no way. Custom fit. Okay, that's a little. Uh, it seems like they're capitalizing a little too much. But uh, Printful, just sign in and make an account, and you can start making easy print on demand services. So this is a good way to make money. Um, I thought of making different ways to make money. None of them really. Um, they're all. They're all hard. If to, to make money, you need money to make money. But with this way I don't see why not you can't start with zero dollars all you need is just uh, your, your imagination your determination your drive is what makes you able to have this now obviously this is not ideal obviously I'd want to make this site a little bit more professional and remove the stock images put some real images have maybe some people who actually buy the stuff put in the um, put in you know pictures of them wearing it you know make it more legit Maybe give me stuff a logo, you know. Maybe make some funny stuff, but uh, overall, this is pretty good. Maybe uh, get a custom do get a custom domain, register it. You know, I think that'd be pretty cool. Get rid of that, and then eventually, I made it so that you know, you know, I have a forum. For example, I posted uh, right here new designs, a thread, and on my thread it says, "What new meme designs do you guys want?" So if you guys wanted to go on this website, you guys should go on the website, comment. Hey, I want to make a clown shirt or whatever. So I'm a bad speller, but uh, yeah, you can just comment down below and be like, you know, sign in with a Google account automatically. Uh, just comment what you want, and then boom, I, I would implement it. And to me, I make I make profit, and I don't lose anything. You guys get cheap shirts. I make a profit. Everyone wins. Everybody wins. So that's, that was my idea. All I need to do now is figure out something marketable. For example, I had to I had to recreate some logos that my school wanted, because my classmates they want to get some shop apparel. Because depending on, for example, I uh, go I take electrical or I take uh, pre engineering, which encompasses computer science, um, cir um, electronics, and robotics. So uh, this is the this is the retro logo that I had to recreate. Then the electrical logo that we have here, another class, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I was thinking about doing more apparel, and I thought this is a pretty good way to make money. So um, yeah, uh, that's pretty much it on uh, my website and my uh, uh, idea. Um, comment on the video, guys, if you think there's a better way to make money, or uh, if you guys like my idea. Um, I'm a big fan of uh, Graham Stephan. I watch his show a lot, and um, I took a lot of inspiration from him. So uh, that, this is me, and uh, I just want to share an idea on how to share the wealth, basically. So, yep. Alrighty, so um, that that's the website for you guys. Um, I'm thinking... Um, Now, if I now for another video that I could do, if you guys really want to, is that I could um, actually make it go live and have because that right now I have it so that it does not process payments. So I could have it. Uh, whereas you know I would go here, right? I go to the shop and I pick out what I want to buy. I want to buy this nice Corona T-shirt because why not? It's the reason why we're all watching this video, right? Uh, select uh, black is classic. I like it. A nice medium. It's nice, and then add to cart, boom, and then view cart, 
Let's see what's my card going to say. Oh, look. Subtotal. 1045. Right? Shipping. It's free. There's, there's nothing. It's uh, SSL, secure shopping. Uh, it's, it's already encrypted. It's got the HTTPS. Ready to go. I click checkout. And then boom. I don't have it so that, you know, I don't have a pin method connected. So I, I could just put like a, my PayPal account, have it all go to me, and then make profit. And the way it works um, with uh, Printful is that basically the money goes to Printful and then Printful makes a profit and then I get the money back if that makes so like let's because the shirt costs like I think it's like seven bucks so seven seven dollars something like that and uh, Printful probably makes a dollar profit something like that I don't know they have to make some profit because how are they gonna you know so then uh, you know, you guys buy it from Printful because it's print on demand. You guys, you guys aren't buying from me. You guys buy from Printful, and whatever I set the price as, I set it as ten forty-five. I make two dollar fifty cents profit, and then there we go. Uh, easy money for me, and I never have to touch the object. So that's pretty cool. So there you go, guys. That's how you do uh, drop shipping. Easy free and you don't need any money for it at all well that wraps up today's video hope you guys liked it and uh, I'll, I'll be back for another one